Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will show you how to install MongoDB database and how to do basic CRAD queries operation into MongoDB database. Hope you will get basic clear concept of MongoDB queries. In my next videos, I will try applying MongoDB with ASP.NET Core or Blazor project. So please subscribe this channel and press the bell icon for getting next videos notifications. So let's start today's topic. First, I'm going to download MongoDB database and then going to install it. So first Google MongoDB download community. Click this link. I will give this link in video description. So platform windows package MSI. Click on download button. So after completing download, I'm going to install MongoDB. Double click on it. Next, complete. Next, install. I am selecting this option because I am recording this video. After completing this installation, I will re restart it. So press OK. So MongoDB installation is done, but I need, but I have to restart my PC. After restarting, I will continue my video from this stage. So PC restarting done. Let's go to C drive. Here we can see a folder named MongoDB. Open it. Server 4.4 version. Bin. Here we can see a mongo.exe file double click on it from this command we will do mongodb related query operations first i am going to show existing database of mongodb for that i have to type show dbs here are the database admin config and local remember one thing these comments are case sensitive now i am going to create my own database database name will be school db for that i have to type use use school db let's see existing database list show dbs here we can't see school db database because school db has no table or document if I create a table or document into a school DB, then it will show in this database list. So let's take a table named students in our school DB. So type db dot 
table or document name students dot insert have to insert one data name will be sakib role 1001 and is 20 insert it one to so type show dbs sorry show dbs here you can see our database is full db now from this database list i want to use is school db so i have to type here use school db remember everything is case sensitive so is to db school db okay now i want to show the collections of this database collections so there is one table which name is students now if I want to drop this table, then I have to type db dot students dot drop. True. Now I want to check the collections or table list of school db database. Show collections. So no collections or table exist. Now if we want to drop this whole database, then we have to type db dot drop database that means currently selected database will be delete which is school db if we press enter drop school db okay now i'm going to check the database list so show dbs now we can see school db is deleted so this is the basic queries of mongodb in my next video i will show you complete crat query operation of mongodb thank you